Hello everyone. Today, I would like to show you how to create chilled water pipe and condenser water pipe with color code in Revit. In the picture, chilled water pipe with insulation in the left and condenser water pipe in the right side. I will use the RGB color code in the table below and create the material for the pipe system. Before jump to the Revit, I would like request to subscribe the channel and click the notification bell for the next video. Ok, let go to Revit. Open the new project and go to browse. I select systems default metric template. Also can use mechanical template. To draw pipe, go to the system and click the the pipe. There are three default pipe type in the properties. Today tutorial is creating chilled water and condenser water pipe, so I select the chilled water pipe. I choose 600 mm pipe size. Before draw pipe, change detail level in fine. OK. Let change wireframe into shade view. We can see the default is gray color. Go to edit type and duplicate the existing pipe. Create for the condenser pipe and click OK. Draw one more pipe for condenser pipe. Before create the piping system, let create the materials for pipe. To create material, go to manage and click the material. Search for carbon steel. Right click on steel, carbon, and duplicate it. Rename it for CHWS and click apply. And add the shading RGB color code for CHWS. R is 0, G is 145, B is 201. And click apply. Right click on CHWS. Duplicate and rename for CHWR. And add the shading RGB color code for CHWR and click apply. Right click on CHWR. Duplicate and rename for CWS. And add the shading RGB color code for CWS. Click OK and apply. Do the same way for CWR. Click apply and OK. To add material to the pipe, click the pipe and go to the piping system. Go to edit type. Duplicate the piping system and rename to CHWS. To add material, click on the material by category. Search for CHWS and click OK. And add the color for line graphic. Add the RGB color for CHWS. Set 1 for line weight and click OK. Rename the system name to CHWS and click Apply. Check in the wireframe, color got changing. Go to system and draw a new pipe for the chilled water return pipe. Select the pipe and change the pipe system type to hydronic return. Select the hydronic return pipe. Go to piping system and edit type. Duplicate the hydronic return and rename to CHWR. Add material by category to CHWR. Change the RGB color code for graphic override. Set line weight to 1 and click OK. Select the condenser pipe. 
Go to Piping System and Edit Type. Duplicate the Hydronic Supply and rename to CWS. Add Material by Category to CWS and click OK. Change the RGB color code for Graphic Override. Set line weight to 1 and click OK. Select the condenser water supply pipe and create similar. Change the system name to hydronic return. Select the return pipe. Go to piping system and edit type. Duplicate the hydronic return and rename to CWR. Add the material by category to CWR and click OK. Change the RGB color code for graphic override. Set line weight to 1 and click OK. Check in 3D view. Back to floor level. Go to manage and create a new material. Search for insulation. Right click on insulation duct warp and duplicate. Rename it to insulation pipe and click apply. Add pattern for surface pattern. Select steel pattern for pipe insulation. Add pattern for both surface and cut pattern. Click apply and OK. Select the chilled water supply pipe and add insulation. Duplicate the existing and rename to pipe insulation. Add material for pipe insulation. Select the insulation pipe material and click and OK. Set 50 mm for thickness and click OK. Select the return pipe and add insulation. Check in 3D view. OK, now creation is complete. If you like the video, please click the like button. Thank you for watching.